What is up everyone, Bo here from BC Hub. I just have to ask, with all of these diamonds going around and the thousand point stuff, you think old Bo never got anything like that? You better wipe that from your brain because I did. I got one. I think it's cool even though it's, I know it's, it's, a, it's probably a bug. And you know, how do I know? It could have been a 956 or something like that, but the bug made it a thousand. I'm, I'm, I don't know what to think about this whole diamond thing. Um, I'll be happy when it's over so I'll know my diamonds are legit. But at the same time, it sure made me happy when I found this guy. And I'm uh, super excited to share it with all of you. So let's get into it. What have we got here? A level 5 Springbok. Ah, I'm to readjust myself in this chair. What am I, Irish? Readjust myself in this chair here. Now I know I don't have my consec up all the way, but if we just lay down here, and it was broadside, but I think it just turned here. There we go. I think we could still get a pretty decent shot on to get 100%, but with nothing really pressuring me, I think I'll just kind of wait for it to turn a little bit more. There are plenty of Springbok around here to get our consec back up. Just getting a decent shot on this guy while we can. Let's see if we can move over to get a more broadside shot. It's my experience that when you move to get around things to get something, they end up turning so that this new spot doesn't work either. Let's see if that's the case. Yep, look at that turns so that this spot doesn't work either. So I think this is just going to have to be a waiting game to see when he turns. There we go. That's the moment we've been waiting for. Oh, you bastard. He turned broadside and then turned right towards us again. There we go. Stop. Don't don't move again. We dropped him. Alright, let's get some Springbok to check our consec here. I would take a shot on the run, but I really don't want to track him from a wound. Oh, okay. I think I was at 40%. That one will get me to 60%. And we'll see if we can get this other one here. Just get a shot on it to do something. That one's going to go down too. Oh, it brought us to 80%. That's even better. At least I'll know I'm at 100% when I get this one. Wildebeest down there. Wouldn't that be crazy if that was a... 100% good sack. Not a diamond wildebeest. Let's go find our Springbok. It was a pretty decent Springbok, I kind of, like, it was probably one of the best Springbok I've ever seen, and I wonder if it is one of those glitched Springbok because it is just so massive. Um, we will see when we get up there, those mountains in the background. Alright, enough of that. Wow, yep. That's one. And look, see here, Verhonga Springbok 89.84. This is actually, this is actually an actual Springbok. I'm gonna tax or demise it before anything can happen. But wow, I mean, still could be, um, still could be glitched, I guess. I'm not entirely sure, but I mean, I have the minimum weight for a diamond springbok at 89.84 and this is 92.59 so I mean that 
That is amazing, you guys. I mean, that is really, really cool. That is a giant springbok. And here it is in the lodge. A thousand springbok. Bugged or not, still looks great in the lodge. I think it's a great addition. I mean, look at all these poses. And they look so much better when the horns are so big. Just to let all of you guys know, um, ladies and guys, sorry. Um, you know, the area that I was hunting in is right here. It will be featured in my For Honga routine video coming out soon. Um, so look forward to that. Like and subscribe, as always. And hunters, keep hunting. Don't stop.